when I first started out in this business in 2007, I, uh, had, I just sold another business and I decided I wanted to get into another business that was more rewarding, more exciting, something that I could actually make a difference doing. Well, customers don't want to pay for your services. Motor clubs don't want to pay for your services. They think their tax dollars that they pay covers my services. We recently had a rollover accident where it was at 10 o'clock at night. We went there with two of our big heavy wreckers to uh, upright a tractor truck crossing both lanes of the highway. We got it up and out of there in less than 20 minutes. After we were on scene, it took less than 20 minutes to hook it up, pick it up, tow it, and tow it back to our lot. We wanted to get paid for our services. This trucking company promised that they would pay us. Well, we didn't know exactly what we were going to have in it, so we took it back to our lot. The next day, they called us. They wanted it. Uh, they wanted to pay for it and have it towed down to their their lot. They ended up giving us three com checks, and only one of them had a good express code. We tried to get a hold of them and let them know that the other one that the other ones didn't have a good express code, but we, they just kept messing us around. So we didn't get paid, and we're stuck with a tractor trailer. Those are the situations that you can get into. Yeah, I know eventually I can sell the tractor trailer. I can sell it for salvage, but in the meantime, I have fuel bills to pay. I have employee bills to pay. I have overhead to pay. I have to pay for insurance. This is the type of treatment you get from some trucking companies. We have to go out in the middle of the night. We have to bring a half a million dollars worth of equipment and risk our lives to go out there and solve a problem that their driver made. It's hard to put a price on it, but we do, and we put a very fair price on it. But they still feel like they're getting jacked around, which is not the case. So anyway, that's what this channel is going to be about. BS like that. Stuff that happens to me. And I want you guys to send your stuff so that we can put it on, on the World Wide Web YouTube. And then um, everybody can know what's going on out there. Um, if, you dis if you dislike this... That's fine. Give me a thumbs down, or if you like it, give me a thumbs up. Um, but anyway, I'm going to keep doing it whether you like it or not.